to viewers. I have not done a video in forever. So this is 365 and I thought I would do this one because, well, I've had this hanging around ever since I got sick and I really wanted to do it. So here I go this month, I'm gonna do it. So this is what it started out as. Well, it had stuff in it and I forgot to film that part. So I got this for $3 at my local, you know, garbage shop and I pried it apart. It was awful. Maybe it was $2 and it had like old dried out brown gross stuff in the little compartments, you know, and it, you were like, oh, nobody wants that. But what I saw was a shadow box. You know, that's what I saw was a shadow box. So wait till you see what I'm going to do with this shadow box. It's going to be seriously Christmas. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to paint this and we're going to clean the glass. Okay. So actually, I should tell you that I'm only planning on painting like the insides here. I'm not planning on painting the uh, bottoms really well because we're gonna put paper on the back there on this part. So we don't have to paint that really well. Here it is, it is all done, and I'm trying to show you all the bits and the papers and things. This was a put together of a whole bunch of different things. So all of those little Hobby Lobby bits, those are on those clothespin things, and there's sparklies from Concord 9th, and there's some pins in the bottom there, and people sent me brads. That's all kinds of stuff and papers that I had left over. And you just stick them in there and I thought I was recording while I was making it and I wasn't so yeah that so yeah okay now I want to show you what you're looking for okay so something like this this was at my local so I just went back and I got it because I went to when I was working on it I I showed you how to take it apart and stuff like that but the camera was not working ah because i'd put it on picture instead of video all right so this is the same kind of thing so i got this i'm gonna make this into um a picture a pin display for our um 
national park pins that we get. I'm gonna paint this silver. I may leave it this color, I don't know, but I'm definitely gonna put in some cork in the back of it, and then I'm going to put um, green. So national park green instead of this each day as a gift. But you know, all it takes is, see, this was, she had bought it somewhere where it was sale price, it was $7.99. I got it for $3.99, except I got it for $1.50 because the day that I was buying this, all home goods were half off. And I got the same thing on this because see, this was $5, except it wasn't $5, it was $2.50. And I'm gonna be doing the same thing. I'm gonna be, you know, this is brand new. Nobody's ever played with this. Um, but I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna pry this out of the back. See, there's the picture hanging frame. Um, this one doesn't have glass over it, which is just fine. I don't need it to have glass over it. So I think this is gonna be very cool and I'm gonna pry this off of here. I don't need this. I mean, all you have to do is take all the stuff out. You know, you don't, you don't need what you don't need and you just pry it all up and out. This is just glued in here. So you take your, you know, you take your handy trusty whatever it is. Oh, it's not even glued down. So, you know, you'll take your handy trusty whatever it is. In this case, it's my little thing. I'm gonna take some pliers I have. There we go. Pliers, you know, and you can pry that off of there because you don't need that. Woo, gone. Same thing for this, you know. There you go. And you just uh, keep prying and keep prying because I don't need the family. I don't need the family. Come on, come on. I might need. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's good. See, I, I, I mean, don't be afraid to bend and break and things like that. And this one, this one's going to be even easier because this one is going to be prying these out. You know, and these are easy. This is going to be easy. And if you have a staple gun, it's going to be quite easy to put it back in. You know? So, I mean, I, it, literally, you just, all you have to do is learn how to take them apart. And you're a crafter, so figure it out, you know? All, you know that you don't want to keep it that way. And even if you break the back, you can make a new back. Um, I don't know about you, but probably you have a husband or a neighbor husband who is a Mr. Fix-It, and they, they can help. You know, so here we go. This is the last one. Ooh, it's press board. No, it's not. That was on there. So let's see if this is she glued it in there. I'm assuming it's a she because that is a piece of scrap paper. So sometimes the best thing to use is your knife. Remember to always cut away from you. But eventually you'll get it. You'll get it free. Oh, there we go. Come on. There we go. Yeah, see? Let's cut it away from me. You know, 
just keep doing it till it comes clean. I'm wondering if it's, if there's another nail in here somewhere. Oh, there is another nail. There we go. There was another nail in here. That's interesting. There's another little nail in here. Okay. But see, you'll get it because there were leather, other little nails in here, but that's okay. Now you've got this clean. You can clean that off. And now you can recover this. Pry these off of here. See, there were little nails. Pry these off of here and cover the back however you want. So that's what I did with this. That's what I did with this. So uh, it really makes really nice Christmas presents because, I mean, they're just really nice little Christmas presents and it uses up all your little doodads, okay? It uses up all your little doodads. You know, all the extra little stuff that you're like, oh, I could use it on a card. And you brought it home and said, no, wait a minute. No, I can't use it on a card. I don't know what I'm going to use it on. You know, get that paint out, get that stuff out. And now I'm going to show you how you actually put it back together. Okay. Okay. So now we're going to put this together. So the first thing that you want to do is you want to wipe off the glass with rubbing alcohol because you want it to be, you don't want to touch it. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. Okay? Because um, rubbing alcohol will A, dry really fast, and B, will leave you with the best clean. Okay? So that's the really good thing. So get your glass in place. And then we're gonna get the frame in place. And now for mine, I'm gonna turn it over because I need to put the hot glue on the other side. Now, I have my hot glue in an old cookie tin, okay? I think this works really, really well, okay? Now, the other thing that I have is these lovely, silicone fingertips from, um, I think I got them from Joann's. I might have gotten them from the Dollar Tree. I don't know, but look for silicone fingertips because they will save you from burns. Yes, I really suggest them. They're very, very good. So this is my hot glue gun. It is now hot, nice and hot. So now what we're going to do and we're gonna put the stand in, and then we're just gonna run a bead of hot glue all along the side. Frankly, what I did when I opened it was I peeled the hot glue that was on here off of here, you know, to get it out. Good old made in China. And they had hot glue on here, and this will keep it closed and keep everything in place, okay? Now, the other thing you can do once the hot glue is done, make it nice, there we go, is you can, um, you can choose to paint the back or you can not paint the back. I think I may paint the back. Um, that may be something I am doing. By the way, the birdies are not in this thing because I'm playing with hot glue. And frankly, I don't, I don't want hot birdies. I don't, I don't want hot birdies, as we say. Okay? We don't need the hot birdies. You know? We don't want the hot birdies. Okay? There we go. So there we go. 
that's good. I'm gonna wait for that to dry. No, give that a little niceness there. My one bird is busy going, hey birdie, 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 birdie. Birdie, 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 birdie. All right. Yeah. So that's pretty thick. So um, it's not quite done yet, but you can see that it's gonna hold it together. So the other thing that you wanna do is make sure, I mean, I had made sure, but make sure you've got these going upright when you put the whole thing back together. But there you go. And there's a nice little uh, Christmas present for a neighbor, for yourself, for a friend, uh, for a family member, homemade. One of the things you want, want to think about doing is peeling all of these stickers off the back and putting your own sticker on here that says, made by you. All right, Christmas 365, something different that you can do. All right, there you go. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to hit that subscribe button, maybe the bell, because I'm back. I'm back, people, I'm back. Talk to y'all later. Bye.